once it is time to open up, what kind of openings does Chandler leave? I mean, Chandler leaves a lot of openings. I mean, Chandler's not very defensive at all. And especially the older Chandler got, I think the more reckless he got. He's not very defensive at all. And I think that Poirier, especially if he starts if he starts using leg kicks and and beating beating up the legs of Chandler early, it's like that's another strategy he can use. The jab movement and leg kicks. If he starts to do that early, he can get Chandler to start reaching and start making a lot of bad mistakes. Because Chandler will make a lot of bad mistakes as the later the fight gets in. But against a guy like Poirier, who is a legit finisher, let's let's face it. If Poirier gets you hurt, he's going to finish you. Let's let's face that. If Poirier can just get him hurt, you know, be defensive in the first round, second round, wear on him and hurt him. Then the third round, he could put him away. But if he can't get out of that first round without getting hurt, Poirier won't finish.